Yeah, it's pretty comfy. This is the first Olympics in a century to be held during a global pandemic. We're here at the Tokyo Olympic and Paralympic Village where athletes will have to abide by a number of rules. It's located in the Harumi Waterfront District in Tokyo, away from the center of town. Built on reclaimed land, the apartments and the village plaza is set to welcome about 18,000 athletes and officials from all over the world. Let's start with the bedrooms. All the Tokyo 2020 beds are made out of very hard cardboard. It's stronger than wood. If you look at the bed frame, see that? But apparently it can hold up to 440 pounds, so no need to really worry. The mattress, though, is pretty comfy, I think. It looks a little small, though, no? Tokyo 2020 is aiming to be the greenest ever Olympic Games. The frames will be recycled into paper products and the mattresses will be converted into new plastics. Next is the place to eat. So this is the main dining hall of the Tokyo Olympic and Paralympic Village. This entire dining hall at one time can fit 3,000 people. They've lowered the capacity from 4,000 because of COVID. If you've ever wondered what a meal for the world's top athletes looks like, here are some of the offerings. Braised beef and vegetables with sautéed cod with herbs, some grilled yellowtail, pork and okonomiyaki, and even some corn and veggie tempura. This is where athletes will eat their meals. Clearly there are these partitions in between each one of these seats. And when you're done eating, you're supposed to wipe it down yourself. Now on to the Village Plaza, one of the main facilities that will function as a social hub with a bank, post office, a photo studio, and a number of other shops. The whole complex was made using 40,000 pieces of timber from 63 local Japanese governments. This one is from Kumamoto City in Kyushu. They'll all be taken down after the games and returned to be reused as park benches and other things. The Olympic Village will officially open on July 13th. Thank you.